Donald Duck has three nephews. Name two of them. Huey and Louie. Who sang about an angel as a centerfold? Aerosmith. What is the only creature born with horns? A deer. As written by Shakespeare, who is Romeo's love before Juliet? Pass. What is the highest title in British nobility? King? Hi. Pass. Four. Number four. Oh, number four. Uh, as written by Shakespeare, who is Romeo's love before Juliet? Pass. Right, not so sorry. How do you think you did, Kim? Not great. Well, we will wave Hot Wings in and see how he does. I never know how to do it. Welcome back, Hot Wings. Thanks. Birthday to me. Was there a birthday party in the hall for you? Mm, yeah, oh yeah, big one. Did you just a go to the fridge one. and stand to the piece of uh, paper taped up that says it's Hot Wings birthday this month and just look at your own photo? I, I yeah. I do that. Uh, I have a lot of photos of me hidden all over the uh, building. I have all 18 years of us having birthdays in this building at home in a scrapbook. Yeah, I never thought about keeping that piece of paper. Yep. That would have been Take them every time. Me, like, you know. Bummer for all the other June birthdays. Yeah. I'm the only one left that has a November birthday, so. I'd be worried. Yeah. All right, Hot Wings, are you ready? Yep. Here to reverie. That Sagittarius is everywhere. Your turn <laughs> begins in three, two, one. Donald Duck has three nephews. Name two of them. Huey and Dewey. What? Who sang about an angel as a centerfold? Uh, the Jay Giles Band. What is the only creature born with horns? Pass. As written by Shakespeare, who is Romeo's love before Juliet? Um, uh, Mary. <laughs> what is the highest title in British nobility? King. Great. What is the only creature born with horns? A goat. Time. How do you think you did? Ah, uh, okay. okay. Ish. Okay. Well, a couple of very <laughs> confident contestants right now. I don't know. I feel like my guesses were okay, but I, I, didn't, I wasn't very sure on a lot. But we'll get Mary back on and score this game. Her name is Kim. Kim, you said Mary. I said Mary, so yeah. That, that, that one threw me off because I was like, okay. I got this one. <laughs> I, Juliet. Would, I did the same thing. <laughs> I'm like, both times she read it. <laughs> <laughs> it's Juliet. It's still not. All right, question number one. Donald Duck has three nephews named two of them. Hot Wings said Huey and Dewey. Kim said Huey and Louie. You could have said Huey, Dewey, or Louie. You both get a point. <laughs> Question two, who sang about an angel as a centerfold? Hot Wings said, Jay Giles Band. Kim said, Aerosmith. The answer is, Jay Giles Band. Two to one, Hot Wings. When you first read that question, Maitland, I thought, Sarah McLaughlin. An <laughs> angel then, is a centerfold. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> nope, not right. I will hear yeah. you. <laughs> So bad. My angel, she's a centerfold. <laughs> really makes those lost pet commercials have yeah. a different feel. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. It does. <laughs> we can take them off in private. <laughs> Question number three What is the only creature born with horns? Hot Wings Pass came back around and said, Goat. Kim said, Deer. It's actually giraffe. Oh. Neither. Oh, oh yeah. Well, they have I forget those little, they have those yeah. little horns because little they're so things. high up in the air. I don't really notice them. <laughs> I wanted one of you Every to say. Every time I'm hanging around giraffes. <laughs> I wanted one of you to say unicorn. Would be great. I thought about unicorn. Did you? <laughs> That's very good. <laughs> you proved me wrong. Still two to one hot wings. Question four, as written by Shakespeare, who is Romeo's love before Juliet? Hot Wings said, Mary. <laughs> yeah, why are you bugging? Kim passed, came back around, passed again. It's Rosaline. 
Rosalie. Neither oh, no. of you get it. They literally Still traded up name one. wise. Question number five. Hot wings. Oh, wait, no, sorry. What is the highest title in British nobility? Hot wings said king. Kim also said king. And the answer is actually Duke. And when I went back and checked it, it also said Duke. Really? But King seems pretty right, too. <laughs> I don't know. You think well, so. Well, I guess I mean, maybe I mean, it's so. different. It, it, it's a different level or something. Yeah, maybe. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I remember a lot of stories about kings going on bended knee to the Duke to find right. out if it was okay to do whatever. So if we accepted King, it would be three to two. Hot Wings would still win. Well, happy birthday, Hot Wings. Thank you for throwing it so that I could win on my birthday, Kim. Yeah, Kim, that would have been really nice. That would have been really pick. sad. <laughs> Thank you, Kim. Thanks for being fancy with us. We appreciate it. You bet. See ya. And uh, just to clarify, British nobility titles are distinct from royal titles because oh. royalty refers to those who are immediate oh. members of the royal family. I see. Got so it's like it. titles bestowed upon. So it was a different category. Oh. Yes. So Hot Wings wins two to one. Derp, derp, derp. <laughs>